the break, Ilana and Roy get into making a delicious tomato soup. You don't want to miss that. Hashtag nom nom. <laughs> Well, it's more than just a nom nom. It's almost ready. In the house is Roy Isham. How are you? I'm perfect. How are you? Yourself? You, I'm very good. Thanks for asking. Normally, you bring us all kinds of exciting stuff that we can learn from you. What are we learning today with tomatoes and with soup? What I'm going to teach you today, Lana, and everybody else out there, is that <laughs> <laughs> this is such a simple soup to make, but the trick to this soup is in cooking the onions. Cooking the onions. Okay, well, I've done that. You have. And look at that. What a superb job So I want to ask, how many onions are in here? That's two onions to about 12 to 14 tomatoes. Okay. How many people does it serve? It serves about four. Or one person, if you're me, because right. I, <laughs> I eat so much of it. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. What do we do? Okay, simply, as I said, guys, the trick is cooking the onions. Right. You've got to put them in there, a little bit of oil, cook them really slow, that it starts caramelizing and it right. ends up something like that. Right, they are caramelized now. There we go, what now they are looking next? perfect. Next, we go straight in with roughly about two cloves of garlic. Okay. And you don't want to cook the garlic for too long. You so just does want it become to... bitter when you cook it too long? The, the garlic does. Yeah. The onion actually becomes really sweet, and that will make this tomato dish exceptional. Okay, next we do... And as you'll see, this has only got three ingredients, except obviously the salt and the sugar. But right. you've got your onions, garlic, and then literally bomb all of your tomatoes in there. Now, how long does this cook for? Because, you know, a Roughly. lot of tomatoes is quite intimidating. <laughs> Don't let it be intimidating. You just want to stir that around until the tomato starts breaking down. That will right, release right. all the waters out of it. And then you're looking at simmering it for about half an hour. Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. As simple as that. So all you need is just a little bit of salt, mm -hmm. probably a pinch or two. Cook those tomatoes down until they start bubbling, until the tomatoes are really cooked to mush. Then all you do Get in there with a hand blender. No need to take it off. Right. Simple hand blender. Just mix it all up. Right. So it's blended. And then sugar. Sugar to take away the acidity and give it and give it a much more sweetness. Could you put okay? honey in? You could. Nothing wrong with honey. Right. But I like the sugar. You like the sugar. Come along. This, okay. is, this, is, this is my recipe here. <laughs> this is Come his on. recipe, I know. <laughs> but I'm trying to change it already, as I do in the uh, kitchen. Now, it's really easy. You can make this at home and recreate it too. Your keyword for this morning is soup. Soup to 33728. Of course, all those recipes charged at 1 Rand 50. And it means you get a link to the recipe. You can click on it. Also, we'll put some lovely pictures for you on our Facebook page. So start clicking and liking the page right now. So uh, the Facebook page is Espresso Show. I'm stirring here you because, are doing a listen, this is probably going to be a delicious stock that you can use in all kinds of things, right? Anything. And okay. we're going to show you right now. What Which you can do reminds with the me, after the break, we're souping it up. We're going to use this rich tomato stock to make all kinds of other mm. things. Roy, you stay with us. I'm you stay with anyway. us too. We'll be back after the break. <laughs>